so for this now we will learn Huffman coding to compress the size of our sent data so we have these character and their frequency are given okay so what we do we initially make a forest of trees so each node is now a tree with root only one root is or node is there in the tree and each have their the frequencies are their weight okay so we have a e i s t p n and their weights are given now what you do we merge the two smallest trees okay so we merge so here which two trees have smallest weight n and t one n and s so they have the smallest weights we merge them they become the leaf left and right child of and now the root is t1 and it has a weight of 4 which is the sum of weights of the other two it's two child okay so now we have this in the second stage this is the thing again here we have now five six trees the minimum weight now is t1 and this t okay so we merge them so t2 is now it has t1 and its right child and t as its left child and the total sum is 4 plus 4 so 8 so this tree has weight of 8 others are still a e i p are there t and t1 are gone okay now which has the smallest weight this is 8 and here there is 10 so these two are smallest so we make t3 a is the left child and t2 becomes the right child its weight is 18 we have e i p left here this has weight of 18 so the minimum weight among the four trees is now with i and p so we combine them here so t4 is formed with weight 12 and 13 so total 25 so the state after this merge is t3 with weight 18 t4 with weight 25 e with weight 15 the two smallest are these two we merge them we make uh, t5 e is its left child t3 is its right child okay now t4 is there t5 is there these two trees are there we merge them we get t6 weight is total weight is 33 plus 25 58 and now we form the tree so t4 is the left child t5 is the right child it's the final tree is this one and now what we do each of the left child is getting a zero right one is getting a one and if you make like this so the child all the leaf nodes i so the code word for i is just move from the root to the leaf node zero zero is for i for p it's 0 1 for e you have to go from 1 0 so e is 1 0 a is 1 1 0 n where is n so n is here so 1 1 1 1 0 s is 1 1 1 1 1 and t is 1 1 1 0 okay so we see we have code words of length 2 then 3 4 and 5 okay now what is there what's the intuition behind choosing the smallest two trees and merging them okay so if we choose the smallest two trees so here you see the smallest ones are getting here and now we are merging the trees okay so this t1 was initially formed it was now combined with t2 so it became deeper much deeper in the tree again it was combined so the smallest weight nodes or most infrequent nodes will go at a higher depth because they were merged earlier and so new heights are added while merging a new node is added so it means if uh, some nodes have very less weights they, they will be merged initially and they will be at a greater depth so they will have longer code words the one which is already very uh, high weight which has got high weight it will merge in the end so it will be at much lesser depth in the tree so they will have smaller code words so this is why we have a greedy algorithm for Huffman coding 
and it gives us the very good compression ratio so here if we see so because this t and so this 0 0 so this is i t is occurring four times i is so four into four length so these many bits are required for i it's 12 occurring 12 times into 2 p is occurring 13 times into 2 e is occurring 15 times into 2 a is occurring 10 times into 3 and n is occurring 1 time into 5 s is occurring 3 times into 5 so this 146 is the total weight initially it was 174 if we assigned 3 bits to all of the code words so this is the benefit we are getting so this was about Huffman encoding so I hope you understand this so thanks all